Hi friends, so I'm today back with uh, another update uh, on the fertilizer of planted tank and as we discussed last time, we discussed about the deficiency of nitrogen and why to add nitrogen in the tank. So today I am back with an important update for phosphorus. Okay. So let me first of all tell you what are the symptoms when you see that you know your plants are dying because of the phosphorus deficiency and what are the symptoms which you will see. First of all yellowing and you know falling off older leaves that is the first symptom of the phosphorus deficiency wherein you know with uh, partitions of you know dead tissues and your leaves will like filthy specifically the old leaves and if I talk about you know the other things you know phosphorus deficiency can cause an increase in spot algae which is the green spot algae which is generally comes on the pebbles and specifically the glass of your aquarium and uh, last time I you know forgot to tell you about the nitrogen and phosphor these are the two things which also comes from the fish waste you know like in the form of nitrate and then the beneficial bacteria convert them into the nitrogen which plants can utilize however this particular substance uh, you know be permanently measurable and permanently maintained in addition plants can you know store phosphate really well so if you are adding uh, phosphorus regularly in your planted tanks then you know you don't have to you know worry about it it's uh, not kind of an uh, you know element which is not present in your tank actually as I told you that uh, the food waste which comes in your tank like you know excessive food whatever the waste which fishes are producing that also you know kind of produces phosphate which in turn all the beneficial bacteria convert them into phosphorus which plants can utilize and plants can store phosphorus in them for long time so if you are giving you know CO2 supplement in your tank and uh, even if you add this phosphorus once in a week your plants will do really well there is no issue about it so but this is one of the important uh, supplement you can say or a fertilizer which you should add in your tank and if you have uh, you know high quantity of fishes in your tank like a good population then even if you're not adding you know phosphorus it will not harm but you have to make sure that you know the fish waste if you have high density of fishes in your tank the fish waste should be controlled if phosphate level is increasing and you if you see a lot of you know green spot algae then you need to make sure that you are doing regular water changes and in your filter media you need to add few things which control phosphate so that you know your tank remains algae free otherwise green spot algae looks very ugly and specifically it comes from your glass then you have to you know take a scraper or an algae cleaner the magnetic ones a lot of products are available in the market but that's another hassle so just try to control all these things and keep your tank well balanced so you don't have to you know do all these things okay so once again thank you so much for watching and if you like the information please like my video and to support my channel, please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching once again. I will come back with another update shortly. Thank you. Bye-bye.